What's up, y'all? LT here back with another video. So today's video is going to be another episode of my Am I the Asshole Child Free Edition. So I saw this story off of Reddit and I wanted to go ahead and read it to you all, read it to you all today so we can go ahead and decide who is the asshole in this situation. So um, just like normal, just like my uh, parent who regret child free, uh, sorry, parents who regret to be uh, having kids stories, I'm gonna go ahead and read you guys the stories. I'm gonna have you guys comment down below. Let me know what you do, this, do in the situation and who is the asshole in this particular scenario okay so shout out to the child free gang i appreciate all of your love and support for this channel i'm almost at 3,000 subscribers so please if you are not subscribed to my channel please make sure that you do so and make sure you hit the notification bell so you know exactly when i upload okay all right so let's go ahead and get on with the story all right so the title of this one is called am i the asshole for getting back together with my child free ex after my divorce my current girlfriend and I, who are both 43, were together for 10 years when we broke up because I wanted children and she didn't. A few years later, I met my now ex-wife who's 36 and we have a happy marriage for at least half of our marriage until we grew apart. She's the one who asked for the divorce. We have three beautiful children together and the divorce was finalized three years ago. I have reconnected with my ex a year ago and everything has been great. I love her and she loves me. The problem is that I feel guilty because my ex-wife is saying that I was the asshole because I reconnected with my ex because now I have used her to get children and then go back to my ex. She has refused to let me introduce my ex to our children, which is making it impossible for me to ask my girlfriend to move in together because I have children alternately with my ex with my ex-wife week by week. Here's why I don't feel like I'm the asshole. First of all, I met my ex-wife way after I broke up with my now current girlfriend. I never expected to see or hear from her, expected to see or hear from my now ex-girlfriend again. When my ex-wife and I separated, I never planned on contacting my now girlfriend and I only did because a friend of mine told me that she too is single again. Before that, I only heard that she was married and never bothered to find out more. Here's why I feel so guilty by my ex-wife's accusations. Yes, now that I have children, I don't need to find someone who wants to have children, and I even prefer dating child-free women. I have so many issues with this story. I mean, first of all, sir, I, why do you only want to date child-free women? See, this is exactly why a lot of these parents here only want to have these child-free partners because, first of all, why this child-free woman, why your current girlfriend who is child-free is back together with you, I have absolutely no clue. If I was her, I definitely wouldn't even I wouldn't even bother getting back together with you because you only have you have three children so now I gotta deal with the situation of your three kids which by the way we haven't even met yet so we haven't like you know the girlfriend and the children have not met yet because the ex-wife has issues with you know them meeting and stuff the ex-wife has an issue because she feels that she she's the one who you know gave birth to all three kids so she feels that the the guy pretty much used her for children now he decides to go back to the child free girlfriend so I think honestly I think all three of them are insane <laughs> because okay the, the ex-wife is insane because she's is, is accusing the man of pretty much using her to have kids and then he decides to go back to the ex who doesn't have any kids I think the guy is insane because first of all you only want to date child free women that is absolutely insane why do you only want to have a child free partner and then the, the current girlfriend who is child free why are you dating a man with kids I don't get that like I don't get a, that mindset if you are child free meaning you don't want your own children why are you trying to date somebody who has three children right now and then and then like i said he mentions earlier that they haven't met yet because the ex-wife has an issue so what what if they do meet let's say that the kids and the current girlfriend do meet later on uh what if they don't like each other what if the kids don't like her or what if the, or if the girlfriend doesn't like the kids so how is that scenario going to work out so i think they're absolutely all of them are absolutely insane in this story um let me know what are your thoughts about this okay i'm gonna go ahead and put the story in the description box as well so if you want to read it in your own time you can do so but i think all three of them are absolutely crazy okay so uh child free girlfriend if you are watching please just don't don't get serious with this man it's not gonna go it's not gonna go well if you're a child free for whatever reason then you need to find yourself a child free partner i don't know why you got back together first of all getting back together with an ex is not a good idea at all i don't believe in that he is an ex for a reason he has kids and he's only gonna be using you so he says also in the story that um i guess he gets the kids every other week or whatever so right now y'all seeing each other he doesn't have any he doesn't have the kids when you guys are seeing each other i'm assuming so he's pretty much living quote unquote child free when the kids are not with him during the week so it's like that's absolutely that's that's crazy so <laughs> that's crazy so uh child free girlfriend please find you another partner that doesn't have any kids that'll probably be the best solution for you i don't know why you got back together with an ex especially he has three kids now 
yeah don't get too serious with this man i definitely would have been finding me somebody else so so that's my two cents on the scenario uh, like i said i'll go ahead and put the link for the story in the description box so if you want to read it on your own time please do so comment down below let me know what you guys think of the scenario and let me know what you guys would do uh whose side are you on on this story as well please let me know in the comments okay so shout out once again to the child free gang thank you all so much for watching if you like child free content like this be sure to hit that subscribe button hit the notification bell so you know exactly when i upload please make sure you email me if you have any questions comments concerns video ideas or if you want to be featured on my channel for a child free interview please let me know um send me an email to child free black woman at yahoo.com please participate in my child free meetup we're going to be meeting up in vegas in february of next year um i'm gonna make sure i put the event break link as well in the description box as well so please make sure you do register if you want to participate in that it's going to be going down on february 13th through the 17th um in las vegas nevada and i can't wait to go i i've never been to vegas before so this, this is going to be a very 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 good a good trip and i can't wait to meet all of you if you decide to go so please let me know down in the comment section what you guys think of the video give this video a thumbs up and please like comment and subscribe to this channel i'll check you guys out in my next video bye guys